Good morning, folks. We've got a deep analysis of Adalia today, a chemical mystery as well, but the solar storm impacts have begun and so we're going to begin, as always, with the last 24 hours on our star and the space weather here at Earth. We saw a minor coronal surge only over the last day. It was mostly quiet until earlier this morning when an M-class solar flare erupted at the same departing active region that previously released the CME. It is now far enough turned towards the limb in the far side that this eruption will not impact the Earth, just a departing shot as a goodbye before its turn across the other side of the sun. We can see in the solar wind telemetry the stream is enhanced this morning. The first of the two impacts occurred just a bit ago and immediately sparked a level 1 geomagnetic storm condition from that moderately weak impact. Now we wait to see if the second eruption impacts when it will do so, and how strong it will be. We recall from yesterday's show, it was the previous M-class flare from the now departing active region of sunspots, and that the CME was much stronger, but with only a glancing blow impact possible to Earth off the very side of the eruption. We're waiting for that one in the hours ahead, but it might not arrive until tomorrow. Folks, the SVS has released their internal dynamics animation of Adalia. The satellites that take high detail looks at cloud structure, rain, and wind were understandably heavily focused on Adalia as it impacted Florida, allowing for an in-depth look inside the powerful storm that just caused so much damage. Pretty severe conditions in that internal region around the eye wall. Last but not least today, of course we've got a mystery as a rare oxygen isotope is seen for the first time and it doesn't look like they imagined, forcing scientists to rethink how the nuclear structure of atoms is built. Ultra nerds like me geek out on not only such a discovery but how it once again fuels doubt that we know what's actually happening at the tiniest scales of matter. We greatly appreciate your support. We are awaiting that second impact from the solar eruption. We'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6.30 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.